Hi, my name is Kelsey Graffy. My name is Sarah Pran. Hi, everyone. I'm Chad Bell Hi, my name is Ram Alton. My name is Lee Brown. Hi, my name is Jade Hi, my name is Kajaker. My name is Sachin Sijata. When I was 15, I joined the award and I was extremely shy, but I was also extremely troubled. And so having someone around to reassure, guide, and assist me would have helped to break out of the shell I was in and be more open to the persons around me. Now that I'm older and a lot braver, I've chosen to become a peer supporter to help those that might be going through the exact same situation I was in or even someone that needs help in another way. A peer supporter to help the participants of the President's Award Program. Fascinated and interested and so ready to get invested in this because I am of the opinion that this is something that is going to take Trinidad by storm once we have, get the ball rolling and have everyone um, looking towards it. I think it's a really good opportunity to help, especially these younger children who, um, who may not be as fortunate to have someone to lean on. And I'm glad that I might be able to lend a hand or lend a shoulder and give some advice when needed and help these ch children grow and become something be become something that they themselves would be proud of. Um, to me, being a peer supporter is important because from my young age, I learned what is volunteerism and it is a main part of my life so far. I chose to be a peer supporter because I had no idea how to properly help people in need. For example, during this course, it taught me how to effectively communicate with people when they reach out. I decided to take part in this CPAC program, or in other words, to be a peer supporter because I've always wanted to be. You know, I know a lot of persons my age bracket or even younger that's going through a lot and they, they have no one to talk to. You know, and I've personally been there and I, I can attest to what it does to someone's mental state of mind. You know, we as humans, we crave, social, like, crave socialization and Sometimes we just can't do things alone, and that's where a peer supporter comes in. Helping others is not only good for them, nor is it only the right, nor is it the right thing to do. Helping others helps us to become happier, and it's healthier too. When you're giving to someone, you're creating a stronger connection and bond with someone, and actually creating a better society. And I choose to become a peer supporter simply because I enjoy listening to others. I love interacting with others. And I'd love to help anyone in any way possible I can. I choose to be a peer supporter because I genuinely like helping people. And I believe that being a peer supporter will equip me with extra tools to help my peers as well as myself become a better individual. The reason that I want to become a peer supporter is because I believe that I can be a positive change or help be the positive change that we all wish to see in the world today. And I also believe that by helping our participants through their hard times or issues that I can make their will a better place and which is into making our will a better place in a larger scale. I could be able to help others to allow others, my peers, to have somebody to relate to, somebody uh, you just like them so that you know they could feel understood. I believe the qualities that make me stand out as a peer supporter is that I am patient and I'm a good listener. The reason that I believe that I can be a good peer supporter is because I am an active scout leader in Scout City and by me having my years of interaction with my participants, I believe that that has set a good foundation for me to be a great peer supporter. Um, I think I would be a good peer supporter and a good peer helper because I would like to think I'm a very non-judgmental, understanding, patient person and I believe myself to be a good listener. These are traits that I think would make a good peer support. I'm hoping to engage my award family through the lessons I've learned in this program, maybe mind maps or number exercises, but also by just being the person I am and being as friendly and approachable as I can be so everyone feels comfortable to talk to me or come to me if they need anything. So by having one-on-one -on -one sessions via Zoom, Google Meet, 
or any platforms available until we can have face-to-face -face interactions. I hope we can chat soon and I'm always here to lend a listening ear. Time to have activities with my award where we will help communicate and work on teamwork skills. By having an effective team, problems can be solved faster without any negative emotions or feedback. I do intend on working hand in hand with my team to build trustworthy, communicating and dedicating relationships, not only among ourselves, but among our team as well. So that, you know, youths can feel more free, more open up to express how they, how they go through something or what is bothering them. So I believe that the knowledge that I've gained from this program will help me in the future to connect with that person or give me that ability to listen and respond more effectively and that's exactly what I'm looking So in the future, my goals are to listen, give advice and you know just be there for someone and making their life a little more money. I plan to do this via virtual check-ins and when possible one-on-one -on -one sessions. Thank you and I hope to see you soon. I want to engage your work community via face-to-face -face communications as well as virtual check-ins because these past few months and even a couple of months to years were very trying for a lot of us, especially mentally, and you never know because one conversation could mean a whole lot to someone. And um, I just want to tell anyone out there you know you could do it you're amazing you you could do no one could do what you could do best if i could say it like that or you are the best at what you do there is no one like me out there there's no one like you out there and you know life is worth living life is worth accomplishing anything you want to accomplish and that's all peace and love have a good day